Child custody exchanges can be precarious moments for survivors of domestic violence. Yeah, a new law aims to provide people a safe place to exchange their children. We truly believe in safety and security for everyone. Polk County Sheriff Grady Judd says most child custody exchanges are peaceful and uneventful. But occasionally we see an event where the family just can't stand each other. And as a result, there needs to be a safe exchange. Substations in Polk County already have safe child exchange areas. The new law signed by Governor Ron DeSantis in early June requires every sheriff's office and substation in Florida to have them. The area must be designated with a purple light or sign. It must be accessible at all times, have adequate lighting and a continuously recording surveillance camera system. Make sure that there's no crosswords there's no ugliness that occurs because if there is, we'll put you in jail and have a videotape. We see all kinds of power and control come out um, in those interactions. Mindy Murphy is the president and CEO of Spring of Tampa Bay, the state certified comprehensive domestic violence center for Hillsborough County. She says victims and their children are often put in dangerous positions during child custody exchanges, adding people do not always stop abusing after a breakup. I think what the law does is tighten that up, gives a defined space, right, with good lighting, 24 hours a day, cameras, uh, you know, on that spot. The new law does make sheriff's offices exempt from liability for anything that occurs at these locations. The Springs Mindy Murphy says it is still best for survivors to pay attention to their surroundings and follow their gut no matter where they are.